This is the Clover Bias Tape Maker. It comes in, I think, five different widths, and it's just the best one there is. I don't think any of them out there are available, are worth any investment, unless it's the Clover that has this colored plastic inside. So you're going to cut a bias strip. How wide do you cut it? It actually shows you on the package, but you can see when this folds, it's going to end up this wide. So this edge will come in, and this edge will come in, you'll see in a minute. But you just have to kind of play with it or use the dimensions on the package to figure out how wide to cut your bias strip. So cut it at an angle, stick it in the tip, have a pin handy to stick down in that groove there until you get it poking out the other edge. And just get it started. Pin it down. Take your steam iron. Takes a little finagling to get going. Now it's going, so all I have to do is just pull the bias maker and have my steam iron right there at the edge. I wished I'd invented this. Pretty slick. You want to go kind of slow. So that'll make your bias tape, which then you could open this up, stitch it along that line, fold it up, stitch it down. You can also fold this again in half to bind an edge. But that's the Clover Bias Tape Maker.